Wait a second. This sign. It looks just like this part of the flying machine. Let me see. Over there, by the beans. Those look just like these too. And look, that's the wing. Yes, and there's the middle pole. Yes, great, awesome. Um, I don't get it. Look, Mr. McGregor must have found all the parts of the flying machine after it crashed and used them around the garden. It's been here all along, right under our noses. Whoa, ha ha. Uh, I mean, I thought that's what you meant. I was just checking. All we have to do is put the parts back together. <gasps> Mr. McGregor! <sighs> Time to fertilize my veggies. Let's get out of here. Ugh, we're not going yet. This is the best thing we've ever found. We can't just leave it here. Remember what your dad said? Life is one big adventure. Yeah, but what if this adventure ends with me being put in a pie? Lily and I will get the parts back. Benjamin, you put them together. OK, let's hop to it. Off you go. No time to lose. You best be on your Whoa. way. Proceed with care, think fast and stay away oh, yes. And you'll succeed at what you're trying to do So off you go, and you should know The golden reach is waiting there for you What? <gasps> A little more to the left No, right, no, more to the left Benjamin! There. Oh. Wow. That looks amazing! Now that's what I call a flying machine. So how does it fly? Hmm, let's see. Uh, <coughs> that doesn't work. Uh, oh. uh, it's no use. We'll never get it to work. Never say never. We can do it. Does it flap like a butterfly? No. Does it glide like an eagle? Nope. Hmm. <gasps> Right then. Huh? Oh no! Mr. McGregor's blocked the gate! Huh? And one of our escape tunnels! All the escape tunnels! We're trapped! Whoa! My potato! Let's go! Wow! What an amazing invention, <laughs> Mr. Bouncer! Why, thank you! It's my new pedal powered house sweeper! <laughs> is that a box pan chip ringer junction you're using? Or is it a simple frequency expander? <laughs> Lily Bobtail, you certainly know a lot about how machines work. Peter, it'd be a shame if it got ruined in the rain. <sighs> hmm, you're right. There's still time to help. The storm is a long way off. <gasps> I hope you're right. <laughs> OK, time to go. Hold on. You might need this. My turbocharged pocket pop umbrella. Oh, thanks, Dad. Oh, no! No, no. <laughs> Thank you all. <laughs> How do you close this thing? Here, let me try. There you go. <gasps> oh. <gasps> Let's get Cottontail's blanket. <laughs> The coop, you naughty dog cleanser! Oh, yeah, rabbits! Oh, thank goodness! There's a storm coming and I can't get my naughty ah! dog cleanser into the coop! Oh. Sorry, Mrs. Puddle Duck, but we have to get Cottontail's blanket. Oh, gracious me! Come back, you cheeky things! Gotcha! <gasps> uh oh, the storm! we still got time to help. Come on, guys. Come back. Ooh. Over there. Ah. This way. Wait. Uh, hey. There you are. Ah. Safe and sound. I think that's all of them. Oh, thank you. Ah. 
Huh? Oops! Nearly all of them! <laughs> thank you! Thank you! Oh, I'd lose my head if it wasn't fixed to my body! Peter! The storm is getting really close! Ah! Mm, let's go home. You know what my dad used to say? A good rabbit never gives up. We have to get Cottontail's blanket. Let's go! Thank you! Stephen, Freddy, Cecily, Norman! If I have to ask you to stop eating the hazelnuts one more time... <gasps> reinforcements! Excellent! Hey! Peter, Lily, Benjamin, wait up! <laughs> Sorry, Nutkin. We're on a very important mission. Cottontail's blanket. Left at Mrs Tiggywinkle's. We've got to get it. A blanket? More important than gathering food? <laughs> there! Looks just like a rabbit. But he's not sh shivering like this rabbit. <sighs> Come on! Let's go back to your burrow and warm up! <laughs> <gasps> Tommy Brock's in my house. This is bad. Very bad. Very, very, very... We'll get him out. Quick, grab the chair. Quietly. Oh. 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 Spray. Spray. Oh. Oh. Rabbits? Oh. 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 I'll get you. Hey, get... Tommy Brock! Stop that. Lily! Benjamin, run! Ah. Uh. Where'd you go? Uh. Ah. Uh. Eat a rabbit! Uh. Peter, quick! That isn't your home, Tommy Brock! It's Benjamin's! You can't stay! Tough luck! It's freezing cold out there, so I'm not leaving! You can go and find somewhere else to live! I can't believe there's a badger in my house! What if he eats all our food? What if he sleeps in my bed? What if he stays there forever? I'd really, really like my house back. Don't worry, Benjamin. We'll find a way to get him out. Maybe if we make the burrow cold, Tommy Brock will move on. Tommy Brock is only in there because of the nice warm fire. All we have to do is put out the fire. <sighs> How are we going to do that? We're outside and the fire is inside. Oh, no. All the way up there. Come on, you can do it. Quick, help me make some snowballs. Uh, uh. Got it. This will get him out. The burrow will be freezing in no time. <laughs> What I wouldn't do for a nice bucket of wriggly worms right now. Oh, yuck! Rabbit food! Oh, it's cold in here. Huh? Oh. No! Ah, oh, no. <laughs> Rabbits! We have to help. Now, don't go anywhere. I'll be right back for you. And you. And you. And you. Yeah. <laughs> Quick, we can't let him take Cottontail's toy. Follow that owl. Keeping up with an owl would be so much easier if rabbits had wings. Oh, uh. <gasps> A squeaky toy? Why waste time on a toy when there are real rabbits to catch? <gasps> oh no! What's all this noise? <gasps> Tail feathers! <gasps> uh, morning, 
Mr. Brock. Uh, could we have our toy back, please? Nope. Oh. It's mine now. It's not yours. I know that for a fact. First you wake me up, and now you want my toy? Ha! You'll stay away from me if you know what's good for you. Peter, we have to get Cottontail's toy back before she wakes up. Then let's hop to it. Off you go. No time to lose. You best be on your way. This is our chance. All right, it's not much of a chance, but we have to try. You keep a lookout. I'm going in. Pew wee! Do badgers ever take baths? Ah! I don't know which is worse his smell or his snoring. Be careful, Peter. Tell me when it's over. <laughs> <gasps> Please look like Mr. Brock. It, it's Mr. Todd. No, it's Mr. Brock, Benjamin. Remember? He's a badger. Mr. Todd's a silly <laughs> fox! <laughs> 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 oh. Oh. oh, missed again. Ah. Hold on. What a lovely musical sound your wings make. Thump, 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 da 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 da. Thump, 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 da 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 da. How do you talk about music at a time like this? You're about to get eaten. No. Lily, get his attention. Oh, 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 I'm safe. Mr. Fisher, hurry! You're not safe! And I found an exciting new sound for my musical masterpiece. Oh, no! Oh, Mr. Fisher! Oh, that's a rather good right. musical sound, too. Mr. Fisher! Splash! Dun da da dun dun da da! Smash! Oh no! Joe <gasps> Shop swallowed Mr. Fisher! This is bad! This is very, very bad! Quick, Benjamin! The fishing rod! I might not be able to catch a fish, but I can definitely tickle one! Oh, <laughs> that, that, that tickles! <laughs> Turnip for lunch again. How I wish I had some <gasps> meat. Oh, oh dear. <laughs> oh, lucky day. Oh. <laughs> um, terribly sorry to intrude, Mr. Todd. I hope I haven't mm. spoiled your lovely picnic. <laughs> Spoil it? On the contrary, you've improved oh. it. <laughs> Not again. Oh. We'll never rescue him this time. A good rabbit never gives up. We need that fishing rod again. Benjamin? Sorry, I left it at the lake. We can make one. I've got some string and a hairpin we could use as a hook. Just in case, Bucket. Just in case. <laughs> I really must be getting back. Oh, no. I absolutely insist that you stay for lunch. It wouldn't be the same without you. Oh. I say, where are you going? Come down here at once. <laughs> I think I might hang about up here if it's all the same. What now? He can't hold him forever and... <sighs> Mr. Todd will still get him if we drop him. <laughs> Leave that to me. Hold tight. Peter, be careful. Frogs aren't supposed to fly. And foxes aren't supposed to stand on tables. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> 
Great, Mr. Fisher! 